Hi, I'm Dorinda, welcome to Yoga Sites. In this next video, we'll be working on strengthening your quadriceps and your outer hips and thighs. So getting some really powerful legs so the energy can run better and more efficient in your practice. Enjoy. Feet together at the front of the mat again. We're gonna inhale the arms up and exhale, fold forward. Lengthen halfway up, flat back. Exhale, chaturanga, low plank. Elbows go back and in. You can put the knees down if you need to. Inhale to upper dog or cobra. Exhale, back to down facing dog. Keep the weight in the knuckles, out the fingers. And stay with the breath. We're gonna step the right foot forward, keep it close to the right side of the mat and stay down. Stay down, bending the right knee to get your right armpit almost over your right knee. Come over as far as you can and bend your right knee a little deeper. You're gonna feel the muscles in the right quadriceps start to turn on. I want you to bring your hips in towards the center line of the mat or towards the left side of the mat and push your right knee back open to the right. Keep the knee bent, lift the chest, lengthen the spine. If you want more of a challenge, you can lift one arm or two arms. You don't have to do that. It gets much harder when you do that. You can also lift your toes. You don't have to do that. <laughs> Breathe. Two more breaths. Exhale, place the hands down, step back. Chaturanga, low plank. Inhale to upper dog, and exhale back to down. And take your time, we're gonna step the left foot forward. Grab your ankle if you don't make it in one step. Turn the right foot sideways, stay down. Make sure the ankles aren't overcrossed, and let the left armpit over the left knee. Make sure your knee doesn't pass your ankle either here. Bend the knee a little deeper. Make sure the heel is down in the back so you root sideways. See? And then bring your hips in towards the center line of the mat, which is towards the right side of the mat. And your left knee opens back to the left. So your hips go that way and your knee goes that way. Yeah, fun, huh? Your ankles are a little overcrossed. Take your foot a little more to the left side of your mat. There you go. Now you can lift one arm or both. Keep the knee bent, lengthen the spine. If it's too heavy, just stay with the fingertips on the ground. But this is about finding an edge, which you should be able to find one there. Two more breaths. And then exhale, place the hands down. Beautiful, step back. Low plank, chaturanga. Inhale, upper dog. Tops of the feet on the ground. Exhale, down dog or child's pose. Take a break if you need it. Find the breath again. If you're pushing too hard, the prana isn't running. So you always need to be able to have enough space to breathe, to slow down the breath. Nice, last breath. Thanks for joining us. Please subscribe. See you in the next video.